Hey, I'm Big V, and I'm Brick, and uh, we're going to do a little behind-the-scenes type stuff. Um, I've had a lot of requests over the years to do room tour video, to do a computer setup video, to do a uh, just wear stuff in your room type videos, and I decided, why not? All right, let's do this. So we're going to start off, of course, with the first and easiest for me as I get used to walking around with a camera that, uh, as you know, focus is challenging at best. Um, but here we go. All right. So, right here we have the computer set up with the thermal printer, a uh, little tablet that I use for walking around with my orders to pull them, and then just a external hard drive, keyboard, ruler, pair of scissors, a little uh, display stand here. And then, uh, the other monitor as well, and back here, just have there's old laptop run everything and of course uh, my balls and uh, let's see what else can I show you that is part of the desk setup there of course is this wonderful piece of particle board with the melamine top with another piece of plywood underneath it sitting on an old table frame not originally for it, but we make do with it because it works best. Uh, and then, uh, quality of this video is going to be absolute crap. Uh, of course, the crappy chair that I sit in, it has broken armrests. All right, so at this point in the video, I just whipped right past this area right over here and don't even touch on it. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually doing that little smidgen of editing that I will do. And um, I'm going to show you. So we're just uh, bear with it. All right. We're, we're trying. We're trying. All right. So right here we have Shipping Central. With basically on the lower area, there is some gear and posters. Then more gear and posters and stuff. Next one, there are some baggies in there as well as some uh, padded envelopes. Next one, padded envelopes as well. And then up above there, you're going to have cloth and sticker elements. Um, and here we've got some poly bags and stuff like that. But back to the computer type setup, we have the booming system that powers the room right there, as well as the alt camera view. For those of you that have seen it, that is the alt camera view. And uh, expect there to be more alt camera views in the future as uh, we try to do more stuff interactively uh, with that whole social media platform. All that good stuff. So, that's it. I'll return you to your previously filmed Yeah, and uh, and then I realized I, I didn't even show you any of this stuff right behind me that you look at every video and probably wonder what's going on up there, what is this area, blah, blah, yada, so-and-so, such and forth, and things, stuff. So, once again, yet another edit, and uh, here we go. All right, so the next part is going to be the tour of the table. All right, so here on the table, we've got our Brick Swag Brick Builder Club box ready to have a video made of it. A couple base plates that have just come in recently, as well as uh, a couple items back there. I'm getting ready to go on vacation, and uh, after everybody's going to sleep, I probably can't stop working or Legoing. So I've got semi-organized random unknown 
uh, to go through, which is basically all of the extras from sets that were personal that we had, and just stuff like that. Yay. All right. <laughs> so, uh, we've got this little mini box right here. Um, I don't know why I have it. I, I, I couldn't say no. It was like $5. I was like, oh, okay, it's cute. Not really, but uh, I've got these red pill, blue pill. So uh, getting ready to go out. Um, the quite expensive scale that we picked up for counting. This uh, runs a few hundred dollars, and it's down to the one ten thousandth of a gram. Um, one ten thousandth of a gram is uh, quite a bit of measuring. Uh, the old sealer right here from when I used to seal orders. We got printer right here, which is just used for um, basically international orders. We got some gunk off and Windex over in here. Toilet paper for super runny noses. Uh, tape, scale, lots of lots and lots of bags. And then here we've got all of these, some, just some random sorting trays, trays ready to be put away, and uh, regular stuff as well as purple Skittles. Uh, not because I love purple Skittles the most, just because I have an OCD and it forces me to eat one color at a time. Um, let's see. Is there any more brick link associated uh, stuff? And I'm not showing you. Well, of course there is. Um, but this is the table. And we'll do a fly over here. All the stuff up on top. And uh, this is packages and sig fig trades yet to be opened um, that I need to do. I, it's, hard, it's hard for me to really get the kids organized to get them in here sometimes. Um, and box O kitty brick. All right. So slow. I'm practicing really, really slow camera movements. So that is it going to go into the next video. It's going to be absolutely awful. It's very difficult for me to stare at this dot and not at the camera because I have no belief whatsoever that any of this video will be in focus. But uh, I'll probably bear it anyways. No, it will. All right. That's it. Off to the next crappy part of the next crappy video. Uh, I guess we're supposed to hold it this way, right? All right. So that's it for the uh, the desktop setup. Um, I will be doing a full-on room tour as we progress. But for right now, that's it. That's all. I'm going to be at Brick. Thanks for joining. Wow, I'm really, really bad at doing this whole thing, aren't I? Yeah, you can comment, like, and subscribe, and all that stuff below. We'll discuss how bad I am. I know it is. Uh, don't be afraid to tell me. Later. All right, so that was the first part of the Lego Bricklink room tour show up fiesta extravaganza whatever um 
seriously, uh, hit that like button, right, right, wherever the hell it is, and um, let me know what you think, let me know if you like this, let me know if there's ways that I can improve, um, this may become a regular type of feature on the channel, say we do this every, you know, biannually or something, um, just so people can keep track and look at things. There's a lot of people that like to track um, the growth of the store, not because they're sellers, but because they like the story. Um, I've been told that a lot, which is, um, it's kind of weird because it's, it's my story. And uh, all we're doing is just believing in ourselves. Having the confidence to do this and um, putting it all on the line. So that's what uh, that's what the whole Brick Lane store is about. It's uh, and, uh, well, you guys know that, so we'll talk about that later. Video's long enough. I'm McBee. I'm Rick. Thanks for joining.